station on Space to Ground. Welcome to Space to Ground. I'm Katherine Clayton. This week we lead with science and learn how gravity impacts our immune system. The Celestial Immunity Investigation evaluates the effects of gravity on functional immune response. NASA astronauts Mark Vandehei and Megan MacArthur performed activities to prepare for the investigation's three-week run. The investigation uses lymphocytes, a type of white blood cell, and expands the length of observation, analyzes a wider array of activated immune pathways, and examines the role of age by evaluating cells from elderly and younger donors. On Earth, gravity, convection, and buoyancy interfere with cell behavior in laboratory-based studies, but microgravity eliminates these factors. Results could support development of new vaccines and drugs to prevent and treat existing and emerging human diseases. Just ahead of the Atlantic hurricane season, the ISS crew met with Weather Nation TV to discuss Earth observations from the space station. Meredith, on my last flight, I got to see a hurricane. Um, of course, those are devastating on the ground. From up here, it's hard to believe that something that looks that beautiful is causing that much damage. You can look straight down into the eye of the, of the storm, which is hugely impressive. You see those massive walls, and then you look straight down from the space station with the biggest uh, telephoto lens. Uh, that's one of the most impressive pictures I've ever seen taken from the space station. NASA is a buzz about news on two exciting missions. The Boeing Starliner's Uncrewed Orbital Flight Test 2 announced a new target launch date for Friday, July 30. This uncrewed flight test to the International Space Station is a key milestone towards the first Starliner crewed mission expected later this year. This week, NASA announced an agreement with Axiom Space for the first private astronaut mission to the space station, expected to launch January next year. This mission marks the expansion of human space exploration to non-traditional users as part of NASA's efforts to grow a low Earth orbit economy. That's Space to Ground for this week. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next week. Subscribe for more space. space, space.